sadly, Publish or Paris is a real problem in science and publications are amazing and it's the way to communicate science and to share our findings with the scientific community. However, there is a tremendous pressure on uh, young scientists to publish in high impact uh, factor paper, journals, and their whole work is evaluated depending on the impact factors and the citations they get. Dr. Rosbas on Monday shared with us that the first publication that introduced circadian rhythms to science uh, had only 10 citations over 10 years. So that means that neither the impact factor nor the, cit the citation sometimes reflect the quality of a paper, and of a work and of the researcher. So what we have to do is not to exclude brilliant scientists with great ideas and uh, people who have a passion and love for science uh, from actually doing science because they have not published in uh, the journals with the highest impact factor or because they are not working on something trendy enough to be published there or have enough citations. Open access uh, journals are amazing because everybody, no matter the country, no matter the financial um, problems a center or a university may have, everybody can access it and read it. And actually, it's easier for people to know what you're doing. And this is what we want, for people to know the work we're doing.